The federal government has approved 5 billion naira bailout fund for Nigeria's aviation sector. This intervention is by way of providing 4 billion naira for the airlines and 1 billion for other related businesses in the country's aviation industry. Our correspondent Abisola Adebayo tells us more in this next report. Minister of Aviation Adi Sirika appears before the Senate to defend the 2021 budget estimates of his ministry. At the public hearing organized by the Senate Committee on Aviation, the ministry says it is seeking the consideration of six bills as part of moves to amend existing civil aviation laws. We have seen and adopted the bills of the agencies as presented in the National Assembly Journal as formal, which contains our desired amendments to the existing civil aviation laws. At the same time, I wish to draw the attention of this committee on the need to effect editorial corrections that occurred in the publication of the bills in the National Assembly Journals and to present a few minor amendments to the bill which relates to the core functions and operations of the agencies that are necessary in order to fully articulate the desired amendment of the laws. The agencies, which is NIMEX, NAMA, INCAP, NCA and FAN, including NSIE, will appear before the committee and present the said additional corrections and amendments of the committees for the committee's consideration. He announced plans to commence the disbursement of the 5 billion naira fund to help operators in the aviation sector is the burden of the coronavirus pandemic. The federal government has provided 4 billion naira for airlines and 1 billion naira for other businesses within the civil aviation. We are putting criteria for the disbursement of those funds and uh, once it is done, it will be transparently done and they will be so disbursed. Chairman of the Senate Committee on Aviation, Smart Adeyemi, says the bailout for the airlines is welcomed in view of the crucial role of the aviation sector in the economy. He, however, noted that the sum would not be enough to keep the airline operators in business. In a global economy that is undergoing uh, recession, more so for a developing nation like ours, more so Nigeria, we really want our economy activities to be above average. I think there's a need to look at the airline operators in the view of giving them substantive support. Four billion naira, honorable minister, to have any airline operators in Nigeria. I wouldn't want to see a situation where this airline will have to pack their heads and be sent people home. But like I said in my address, also, if they have to be cutting corners, that is even worse for our nation. I cannot afford to allow airlines to cut corners. Yes, they are business, but they are business the soul of our economic development today. The House of Representatives had earlier in the week asked the Ministry of Aviation to suspend plans to concession four international airports in the country pending the resolution of all contentious issues. Abisola Adeba TV 360, Abuja.